So today we were providing to the soldier a kit that allows the soldier to address the three preventable combat casualty care types of wounds that a soldier would uh, receive or experience in the field during battlefield conditions. The soldier using this kit will be able to obtain the training that is necessary such that he can then stop or prevent the, uh, the, uh, the casualty from, from continuing on, thereby reducing the, uh, the diet of room wound rates. These mannequins are state-of-the-art, high-fidelity mannequins that, that provide a, a more uh, realistic uh, uh, training. Um, in the old days, we used to um, train with, with each other. Uh, we put a tourniquet uh, in my buddy, and then all of a sudden he says, oh, you know, that hurts, that's, that's good enough. But in this case, these mannequins actually provide a more realistic uh, type of training. The soldier, after completion of the training using these particular mannequins, will be able to address um, in, you know, in a very effective, rapid manner these types of injuries that the, uh, that the soldier would occur in combat. During OEF, OIF, 24% of the battlefield deaths that occurred were actually preventable. And, and of those 24%, we've also learned through our, through our uh, data analysis that about 91% of those preventable causes of death actually due to bleeding. The bleed out, the bleed out problem. The uh, the commanders of the 75th Ranger Regiment um, deduced that with proper training to each of the soldiers, the non-medical soldiers, that we would be able to uh, to uh, greatly reduce the uh, the preventable causes of death due to bleeding. These mannequins do save lives, and that's our job. And, you know, in the medical, uh, we do material solutions. Uh, we are. Uh, and designing these material solutions and, and to ensure that uh, our products do provide the soldier the ability to save lives. From this training, as we go through each of the units around the world and give this type of training to them, the 68 Whiskies, who are our Army medics, have provided very valuable feedback to us. And without exception, the, the, the 68 whiskeys who have spoken to us have said, who've had that actual experience of using this training in actual combat, they have stated that they have actually used this training to save lives. It has saved lives for the people that they were able to treat on the battlefield.